Hello YouTube, welcome back to this week's video, 2E0 IQJ. This radio here is the Blue Sky Sea KYT 8900D. Now the box says it's kicking 25 watts. What do you reckon? 25 watts or just another 5 watt radio? Let's find out. Okay, we're up in the shack and this is a KYT 8900D from Blue Sky Sea. Now this says in the manual it's kicking 25 watts on high power and 10 watts on the low power. It's got four VFOs, fully repeater compatible, can program this thing via chirp. So does it kick 25 watts like it's advertised or would it be more, more lies? So we've got it connected to the NICL power and SWR meter and we're going to test it on 2 meters and 70 SEMs. So let's see what sort of power it gives. We're doing high power and low power. Okay, I've gone handheld with the camera and we've got the meter which is RS40 SWR and power meter connected to the radio via a patch cable. So you've got a PL259 plug there, this one there, and this cable goes to my Diamond X50 which is in the garden. The radio is currently sitting there on 145425 and we're on high power. See what power it's going to kick. So I've set the meter to the 15 watt scale and it's on power. So power, 15 watt scale. Oh, look at that. Oh, just over 15. Well, it's hitting the end. Let's turn it into the 60 watt range. Ah, there we go. Around about 19 watts on high power. Let's stick the radio into low power. And see what we're kicking. Stick it on the 15 watt scale. Yeah, look at that. Just under 15 watts. Let's put it in the 60 watt scale. I'd say around about 14 watts or so. It's about 18, 19 watts on high power and 14 or so watts on low power. So let's stick it on a 70 sems frequency. So 433450. And the radio is going into high power. So 15 watt scale on the power. See what, see what it gives us. Just under 10 watts, I'd say about 7 or 8 watts. Put the radio into low power. Now what's it going to give us? Look at that, just the same. That ain't good, look at that, just the same. So this radio is advertised at 25 watts high power and around about 10 watts low power. So high power on 70 SEMs, it was kicking about 8 watts. Low power on 70 SEMs, around about 8 watts the same. High power on 2 meters, just under 20 watts, so about 18 watts. And low power on 2 meters, was around about 14, 13, 14 watts. It's not the 25 as advertised, but on the low power it said it was 10 watts, but it's over that. So uh, on two meters, yeah. It, this radio does get a bit warm across the top there. Okay, that was a look at the Blue Sky C KYT 8900D dual band amateur radio transceiver. You found the video of some use, you know what to do, give it a thumbs up. If you don't like the video, the other button seems to work too. But as always, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. 2E0 IQJ, 7-3.